Saints? I mean, just disappointing to lose, especially in the fashion that we did. Um, obviously, first game, it was a lot of emotion. We was very excited to come out here and play and get a W, but, you know, it didn't work out like that. Um, we just pretty much didn't play well at all on either side of the ball. Special teams, we got out coached, we got out played. But, you know, hats off to them. They're a good team, and um, they proved it today. They're a better team than us right now. This may be a little question, KB, but, but what went wrong and why was it so flat from the start you know, like if I if I knew the answer to that, we would have played better. Uh, and in the, the day, got to definitely watch the film tonight. Um, really, be honest and truthful with ourselves because we just didn't play well, and that's just the bottom line. Uh, we have to be better than that if we want to be the type of team that we are. But as a leader in this football team, I make sure that you know as we watch this film and be honest with ourselves, we just flush it down the drain and get ready for Seattle. And that's the only thing we can do. Talk what me through the Kyler Murray experience? How much more difficult is off schedule and just what he was able to do? How much more difficult did that make it for you guys? Yeah, I mean he ran around, made some good plays. Um, you know, being a quarterback that he is, trying to corral him and get him inside the pocket uh, is definitely tough. And uh, but I did, you know, I, I think we did some good things on defense, but it wasn't good enough, especially on crucial downs, third downs. Uh, we just didn't make enough plays today. Talk a lot about the issues yeah, from last year being put to bed. It seemed like some of them were, were still around today. Yeah, I mean, like I said, I got to watch the film, but at the end of the day, we just didn't play well enough in certain situations, uh, you know, just on, on all sides of the ball. Like I said, I mean, I do have to watch the film to make sure that I can, you know, see exactly what happened wrong, but, you know, just in certain situations, we didn't play well. I got to play better. We all got to play better, so it's the bottom line. You had a pick, Simmons had a sock, you had a flea flick or fake punt, but it didn't seem like anything really propelled the momentum in your favor. How frustrating was that, and is that, that kind of change? Yeah, I mean, Good interception, scored a touchdown. Then we gave a big play on the screen. So uh, we just didn't string enough good plays together to keep our offense in the game, to get them rolling. Um, so like I said, we gotta, we, we just got to be better, you know, in all phases. Kevin, you've been here for great wins, and, and you've been here for some really bad losses. How do you tell your teammates to dig out of this one? Uh, we, you know, we've been here before. Uh, it's a very long season. We, we have 17 games this year. It's not the start we wanted to have, but at the end of the day, you know, we have to – you know, we find out what type of team we are. We have this type of adversity, especially to start the year. I'm going to make sure I come into the building tomorrow with a lot of energy, a lot of juice, a lot of positive energy, because at the end of the day, that's all we can do. We're not going to sit here and mope around, keep our heads down. We're going to keep battling, keep fighting, uh, and get ready for Seattle. Coach Rangel said this is when you guys will find out what your culture really is. Yeah, that's, that's exactly right. Uh, we're going to find out what type of culture we have, what type of guys we have in this locker room. And I know we have the right guys in the locker room. I know we have the right guys in this team to battle back uh, after a tough loss like that. So, like I said, it's a long year, and we're going to look at it just like that. Kevin, Kevin, Kevin do you feel like there was any sense of, I want to say overconfidence, but the expectations of the fact that the preparation you guys wanted to be ready, maybe something that happened that didn't. Not at all. I mean, at the end of the day, you know, I've talked about this before. You know, this game is not played on paper. No matter who we have, who we sign, you know, what type of guys we have in this team, we got to go out and perform every single week. And it's not about, you know, what you said you're going to do, whatever it's about what you do. And we didn't do, we didn't do enough uh, today to win. Uh, we put on a pretty bad performance. So, you know, got to get back to the drawing board. Kevin, what was it like uh, in the stadium today, especially after obviously last year, having been so long? And how badly did you guys want to? You know, reward that atmosphere. No, it was a great atmosphere. Uh, the fans were there. They showed up. They showed out. Um, but you put a bad performance out there, you're going to get boos. Um, and it's, you know, rightfully so, honestly. Like I said, we didn't play well. So uh, can't really expect nothing less. I think our fan base uh, wants us to be a great team, and we want to be a great team, but we didn't show it today. So kind of expected the boos and, and all that good stuff. Challenging the receivers, that was something, obviously, an area of focus. Do you guys feel like you did that enough after seeing the results today? You know, I feel like at times uh, we did, uh, but we didn't do it well enough. You know, we got a couple flags, uh, some touchdowns, different stuff like that. Um, but like I said, I mean, we just got to win one-on-ones, you know. I didn't win my one-on-one -on -one today. I gave up a touchdown, so that, that's on me. Uh, you know, I'm mad enough to say it, but at the end of the day, uh, I think that we challenged receivers at times, but it just wasn't enough.